Julia. How are you doing, sweetie? Being nice for a change? Yes. Well, let me... Let me make a blue star video again because I don't know. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not in great shape. Change, right? Change. I don't do well with change. And I'm freezing. I've been freezing all day. It's about minus 10, but for some reason, wearing those compression stockings, Keeps me warm. And today I'm not wearing them. And I'm freezing. I guess. I don't know. I don't know. That's the only difference that I know. It's the same temperature in here. You know, it's fine. I don't know. Anyway, I um, I woke up. Um, realized last night that I didn't have popcorn. So I thought, I better get popcorn. So, you know, did all my things in the morning. And before I did anything else, I was at the Sobeys getting popcorn. And guess what? Nope. Nope. The popcorn that, that I always get, whether it be at Sobeys or Zayers or anywhere, they didn't have it. They didn't have it. They were out. Because obviously, people are deciding that this family day, they're going to watch a movie because it's not great weather. It's just cold and, you know, we're not doing big family gatherings, but the little family gatherings we have, the home home things, we want to watch movies. So they all went got their popcorn yeah uh, the boxes the the other cheaper type of Orville Redenbacher that they try to sell there are lots of those but the bottles of or Orville, Orville Redenbacher my favorite popcorn was out I said where's where's the uh the Orville Redenbacher in the bottle he says oh it's down here uh there isn't any the big empty area. Yeah. So Julia, I'm down to enough popcorn for me, but not enough for anybody else. So I said to my daughter, you know, well, I just grabbed some other popcorn, okay? Compliments popcorn, the Sobeys brand, because I was at Sobeys and I was not going all the way across town to the Zares. I said to my daughter, I said, well, they're all out. Had she responded quickly, well, I'll, I'll bring mine, you know. But there was no response from her for, I'd say, an hour. And by that time, I'd, I'd said, well, I'm getting the compliments brand and, and gone home. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, and I looked at that stuff, you know, and I looked at the instructions totally different instructions from what Orville Redenbacher use more oil and all this stuff great great and they look they look more coarse they don't look as you know, yeah it's not gonna be as good but whatever so my daughter said oh that's great <laughs> never mind we'll see we'll see I'm going to have the rest of my popcorn when the leaves play. And I'll save the other popcorn for when they're here. Because she could brought in her own popcorn. I don't know if she gets more of a run or not. I don't know. I don't know, Julia. Anyway, so that was that very unsuccessful. I was very unhappy. When I got home, got out, started doing stuff. And 
freaked out because I was not in a good mood anyway. And uh, kind of went, I don't understand how this works. And two emails to Christine later, I settled myself down. I went, calm down, you can find it, did this, did this. Sort of started working in it, but wasn't comfortable, right? Finally, Christine responded to my emails, give me a call. <laughs> so I called her and we talked for 45 minutes and she led me through it. <sighs> I'm still not comfortable. I'm still not happy because it's new and it's change and it's different and it's really not intuitive. But that means it'll take longer for me to teach, right? People will go, oh, no. And some people will not ever get it. Well, you know, that's not why I'm here. I'm here to help them get it. And if they can't get it, oh. So I have been working on it for the last little while. And I started making my lesson plan. And then I went, wait a minute, you've got work to do that you have to give back to them. So when, when I finally got to the point where I couldn't go any further on the Onyx stuff, I went, okay, go to what you know. You know, this is gonna take a long time to do. And I've got two tasks to send back to them. So I, uh, I got the one ready to go. And I've got the other one not ready to go, but I'm getting it ready to go. So this is where I am now, there. So Tuesday will start with me going over the tasks with the students and they did really badly. The morning class did better than the afternoon class, but they did really badly. And they were two really easy People are just not thinking, absolutely unable to think, even the smartest people. So, you know, they don't know how each other did, so I'll just go over it. And I said, I'll go over, the, these are the answers, and that's that, so that'll take some time. And then we will start going over the onyx, and I'll show them, and... I'll, uh, I can't give them that. I'll have to look for something else to give them, but anyway. Tuesday should be okay. Then I discovered that even though I, I was not careful enough in choosing the tasks, the units or whatever, the E units for Onyx for the afternoon and the morning class, and I didn't get the same ones for for both of them and they're they're officially yet sent them to the site and they come back so I don't have the same tasks for the afternoon as I have for the morning so that sort of messes me up but I think that by the time I get used to doing this it won't be such a big deal <clears throat> I hope, <laughs> I hope I get used to this Julia because right now I'm stressing, I'm stressing. But it's Saturday and I've got Sunday and then Monday I will clean the house sufficient for my daughter. Actually, uh, yeah, Monday I will clean the house in the morning they're only well they're coming late coming for lunch basically because she said she wanted to give the baby let him have his nap don't be mean don't be mean yeah. so hmm. my gray is starting to get terribly noticeable no I wear caps. I wear, you know, toques when I go outside, so that's okay. It's not bare 
head weather yet. Ooh, you've got a ridge there. Is that you being angry? Yes, that's you being angry. There's there's a ridge. <laughs> so you must have had an emotional reaction to uh, Aggie there. Because there's a ridge of fur. That's kind of neat. It's not fat tail or anything. But I've never seen that before. That's cool. Anyway, okay, so um, whatever. As you know, as you can tell, I'm stressing out. So I worked as long as I could and decided to take a break, make a video to relax. Because it's after four and I've been working all day. <clears throat> so I'm going to go do the kitty litter, back in the bed, and uh, get supper ready eventually I like to have supper at six o'clock that's it so whatever time there is between finishing doing the kids litter and finishing backing the bed I will do some more work because I that's that's just you know copy paste not copy paste it's just put the names in copy whatever okay and that I will not email to them until um, I don't want them to be pressed, depressed on the holiday weekend either. So I'll, I'll email them that on Monday night, maybe. So that on Tuesday morning, they can go over it with me. I can go over it with them and they'll know their results. And all of a sudden, I don't have access to it anymore. They, it's just weird. But Google Classroom is not, it's not ideal. Because I had access to it last week when I was, oh, thank goodness, marking them. When they sent me their tasks, I, I restarted my computer. Is that what it was? And all of a sudden, now I don't have access anymore? It's just bizarre. In fact, thank goodness I wrote the marks down. But I no longer have access to their to their files. Really? I'm the one who gave them these things and they filled them in and submitted them to me. And now I can't go into them anymore and even look at them? I have to ask for permission? Um, really? I think I'm going away. So this is why, it's one of the reasons, it's not a really great platform. Google Classroom is not ideal. And I think that despite the user unfriendliness, <laughs> the less than intuitiveness of Onyx, it will let me have access. And, uh, and it's Canadian the government has funded. The, the platform itself is not Canadian, but what we're doing with it, right, Onyx, this one, what we're doing with it is entirely Canadian. The whole setup, the whole, um, all the units are all Canadian. So, I paused long enough? Yes, I think so. De-stressed? Well, it's called avoidance. It's over there. I don't have to think about it. I've got kitty litter to do and bed to vacuum. That's why I came in here to vacuum the bed, right? I haven't done that yet, but that's what I'm going to do. <laughs>